My grandfather always said that uh, I'll know that I meet the one when I am with my best friend um, and when I just can't imagine not having that person in my life. And I think pretty early on uh, in our relationship, uh, you, you quickly became my best friend. And I really, I, I always wanted to be with you. Um, I, didn't, I didn't have a lot of times where I thought, you know, wow, I'm really spending too much time with Megan. I really need, you know, some guy's time or, you know, traveling with you, cooking with you, just, just being together. Uh, it's just been amazing. As far as uh, not being able to live without you, uh, you know, obviously during the deployment, uh, I, I saw what my life without you was like, and, and, and even that's not really true because obviously you were still a big part of my life. You just weren't there physically, and you know, we made great efforts to talk and Skype and call and email and write letters and all that, but um, I just was lost. Felt like half of me was missing. to note that not only do I love you, which I do more than anything in this world, but I love us. And that's a key for me. I think there are a lot of people in this world who find someone that they love and they care about deeply, but it doesn't necessarily mean that that person is the best person for them. Uh, and, and I really truly believe that you're the best person for me and I'm the best person for you. And I have absolutely no doubt that our life is gonna be nothing short of miraculous. I really feel like God put me on this earth for you and you on this earth for me.